This is an airsoft mask bought from the internet. I'm going to turn this into a steam tech breathing mask by adding pipes etc. The first stage is going to be to pull the mask apart so I can spray each piece separately. Here's the disassembled mask. I'm going to leave the outer eye piece in its black rubberized form and spray paint and add pieces to the eye lenses and mouth part of the mask. I'm going to mount these male adapters from electrical conduit pipe to either side of the mask. So I'm simply going to drill a hole through and then thread these in. This will allow me to track pipe around either side of the mouthpiece. Here's the mouthpiece with connectors added to either side. This now needs to be sanded down and sprayed. I'm going to block off the eyepieces slightly by adding pieces of plastic on the lower portions and the upper portions just to give it a slightly more steam tech look. I've covered parts of the eyepiece with small pieces of black plastic cut to shape and also added similar pieces of plastic to the mouthpiece. To add additional detail I've added rivets around the edges of these pieces of plastic. These now need to be spray painted. The mouth and eye pieces have been sprayed first with a plastic primer and then with a brass colour. These now need to be coated with a dark brown wash to bring out the details. The mouth and eye pieces have been sprayed with a brass colour and then covered with a dark brown wash to give them a weathered look. Here is the reassembled mask. I'm now going to add conduit piping to these connectors on either side of the nose piece. I'm going to connect the two pieces of black conduit piping at the back of the head using this T-junction conduit connector. The two pieces of conduit piping are connected at the back using a T-piece. And connecting a third piece of conduit to the bottom part of the T-piece allows us to do a tube which can either be tucked down through the costume or can be connected to a breathing bottle. Here's the completed breathing mask. When we use this in filming, this outfit will be topped off with either a hat or a hood.